Yo, what is up guys? Tony here. For today, I'm bringing you an episode of Titanfall 2. This probably is my first episode of Titanfall 2 in this channel, and I gotta say, Titanfall 2 is one of my favorite games in, uh, like, in a while. Like, Titanfall 2, Overwatch, and the Metal Gear series, the Soul series. Like, it hits really, like, big for me, because I love this game. This game's been nothing but great. It kills me that's not doing as great as it should be. But I will be showing you guys the new trailer that just came out where it shows a bunch of new cool things. So I will explain a few things here and there. Let's start the trailer. So first and foremost, they do such a great job with their trailers. The trailers are very cinematic and awesome. Now we're going to see a new execution called Now You See Me. I really like it, but I have some issues with it. Also, the new map, it's called Relic. It's from the old Titanfall. Now, I just don't know how I feel about you going invisible, but that really doesn't bother me too much because there's another execution where you can hook someone and grab them. Now, Tone Prime and his new execution right here looks really cool. I like it a lot. It's pretty savage. It, it's pretty, it's pretty fucking savage. Now, I like it a lot. I like a lot of things about this trailer, but one of the biggest things is the fact that we get a new Titan, guys, which is Monarch He's right now. He looks really cool. I have a lot of things to say about him. Like, he reminds me of Expedition from the story mode. I will show you guys a little bit of what I mean by that. But he has an execution where he robs a battery and then just has it, which is weird. But like I said, I'll talk about that later. For now, Ronin Prime, guys, this execution is crazy. Slashes and then does that. Guys, this, this trailer has been so fucking weird for me. Like, it's beautiful as fuck. So, another entry point for him to go into, which is weird. And another execution, which you do see in the story mode when you kill Ash. Overall, I have to say this trailer was awesome i can't wait to play i can't wait to buy ronin prime but here's a few things that i noticed about monarch so if you guys see monarch monarch has this gun that reminds me a lot about if you guys have played the story mode you guys will know what i'm talking about but it reminds me of this class called expedition where he has the same gun shoots the same and everything his alt is basically his guns like radiate electricity and just goes ham it's basically legion's alt without the aim assist it melts it literally it melts way faster than legion's alt now it's crazy because the gun's the same he even has a rockets which expedition does have but he never showed us the vortex field that ion has now partially because obviously it'd be it kind of suck if he could use vortex shield or yeah if he could use the vortex shield like ion but i think it's gonna be some sort of shield taking ability because he can rob a battery with one of the executions so why would he not be able to rob shield or something like that you know you get what i'm saying guys now i like it a lot i like that gun a lot i feel like the ammo could be a little bit more because it's like 30 rounds i think but if it could go up to like 40 then or 50 or 45 i think would be a good one then he'd be really cool he'd be very viable i honestly like monarch i like everything about him he seems like a really cool character and i can't wait to have him and play him so that was pretty much it for me guys i will see you guys later in the next video I'm going to be doing Titanfall because of the new DLC that's coming out. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know what what you, get, what you guys are excited for. If it's Ronin Prime, Legion Prime, the new Monarch, the new Executions, the new skins that are coming out. Let me know what you guys think. I will see you guys later. Peace.